what is going on everybody? Hello. It is Pixmoners here and welcome back to AI the Somnium Files. When we left off, uh, shit's going down. Yeah. Uh, Iris has been kidnapped. We found out who we were supposed to meet at the, uh, oh, what's the mama's club? Why did I forget it all of a sudden? Golden Yokocho is the alleyway that it's in. Everyone knows what I'm talking about. But uh, <laughs> Pewter is the person we were supposed to meet and is the one that sent all the guards to come get us. And now we're here trying to break Iris out of fucking a high security freezer storage unit. Yeah. And uh, after recording last time, I had a thought. I could be wrong. Well, I mean, she's not in the storage unit. She's in well, the... yeah, she's in the van. Yeah. I had a quick thought. I don't know if it's accurate or not. It's not anything like majorly groundbreaking. But my thought was, of because we're trying to figure out why would Renju want to, like, go this far to get Iris? I mean, that still doesn't quite make sense. But I wonder if, you know, whether we want to say this secret organization, the Axolotls, are real or not. The, you mean <laughs> Nyes? Nyes at Laws? Nyes at Laws. I know. It's fun. I know. But um, what if they're the ones who took that other prototype sync machine and they have that set up in the warehouse? Maybe they're trying to get some kind of information from Iris. And so they're trying to get that all set up. And that's why they're trying to get her so bad. Mm. Is that there's an impromptu sink machine in that warehouse. Just the thought I'm throwing out there. MoMA. Huh. There's a lot. What do you want to ask? One, two, or three? <laughs> I'll start with two. Oh. <laughs> so these bad guys, why did they take Tessa? The van's at the end of the row. Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse is right there. We must be planning on taking her inside. Right now, they're probably getting it ready. They've got lookouts waiting outside. Which one asked me one? The jack-off who took Tessa. Pewter, right? What's his deal? I think Renju asked him to do all of this. I thought of a horrible joke, but I can't say it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> oh god, I really don't know if I should say it. It's such a Dante joke though. Moving on. Uh... Renju. Renju? <laughs> <laughs> I told Mom about Renju and Pewter's relationship. Oh, that's right. Renju was looking for Tessa. Not only that, in a parallel world, I found Iris's body. <laughs> there, there's the, there's the line. There's back to the seriousness, if you can call this serious. <laughs> I've got a bad feeling about this. It's the classic line. All right, what did you want to ask number three? There's a van down there, right? Down by the river, yeah. yes. In that case, <laughs> why don't we go around the back? Unfortunately, that is impossible. That's the idea I had, damn it. houses are flush with the water. The only path to the van is down the front. Our related information to MoMA. Shit. Guess it won't be that easy. All right, let's summarize this whole so, thing up. What's the plan? That jazzy trumpet keeps giving me flashbacks to Dangerova. <laughs> I don't know, like, I know, obviously, this is made with Spike Chunsoft. I don't know if when the writer for Dangerova left, if the composer also left, because it has that familiarity to it that. It does, it really does. I don't know. Still want to probably inform me in the comments, but what's uh, the plan? Well, going guns blazing? While it's coming up with the plan, a car emerged from the darkness. That's Oda. Yep. <laughs> uh, did we call him? I don't think we called him because we, we would have noticed. We would have remembered. How did we? How did he? Oh, both of them. It's like, what the hell's with all the kids? Yeah. <laughs> Zuki, Ota, what are you doing here? What do you mean? You contacted us. What? I sent an aisle message to both of them. Oh, okay. Thanks, Ivan. Why? Yeah. I said only Mizuki. <laughs> Date, if something happens to Tessa, let me know, okay? I'll save you no matter what, Iris. <laughs> promise me. I promise. I mean, we did promise. We did. A promise is an inviolable protocol. It must be followed. Do you know what a white lie is? No, <laughs> I am an AI. You always pull out that excuse when it's convenient. <laughs> Besides, Mizuki can be very helpful. Yeah. Extremely. And Ota? Perhaps it can be used as a shield. <laughs> That's cool, even for me. Damn. But great idea. <laughs> uh, Date, who are the kids? Don't call me a kid. <laughs> Who's the old man? <laughs> Mizuki right. will deck you. <laughs> I sighed and shook my head. I made the introductions quickly. 
So your sixth grade roommate and a knee who's trying to get his light <laughs> novel published? What good are they? Just, just trust me. You don't look very useful yourself, old man. Yeah, you're all short and scrawny. <laughs> Shut up, I'm he's, not short. He's taller you're than you. He's just big. He's not much taller. No. That argument <laughs> is fallacious. <laughs> and you're short too. <laughs> no way. This isn't even my final form. Oh, God. Oh, no. All my joints are folded up. I, I... can get three times bigger than this. What? Liar. <laughs> that sounds disgusting. <laughs> this went on for a bit. I finally got fed up and shouted at them. <laughs> Listen up, you idiots. <laughs> Sorry, Mizuki. You're not here you. because you're all ASET fans. Rally the troops. Yep. Water. Wet. Sweat. ASET. Fears. Upset. Regret. ASET. Gambling. Roulette. Bed. ASET. <laughs> God. Way to go, guys. They have bonded. Yes. Yeah! Yeah! What a bonding moment. Back to the seriousness. <laughs> Iris is in trouble. All right. Let's work together and get our Tessa back. Yeah. yeah. This is our time to unite. Let's show them what we're made of. Yeah. <laughs> shoulder to shoulder. Heart to heart. We stand. Show no mercy for you shall receive none. Yeah. yeah! Why does that sound familiar? I thought the same thing. I remember. I know that from somewhere, but I can't get it at the back of my head. Yeah. This has extraordinary power. Good. Someone's telling me it's a song of some kind. No, it's, 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 it's. I think it's from like a movie or a TV show. Someone said it. Anyways, <laughs> explain the situation to Mizuki and Oda. Here's the plan. That's gonna bother me. Ota, can you drive that vehicle? <laughs> It's bulletproof, so don't worry. They can't shoot you. Yes, sir! Moma, I need your trigger finger. Get on the back with me and shoot any gunman you can see. You got it! And Mizuki... You bet. You're our secret weapon. Yep. If it all goes south, we're gonna need your powers. Leave it to me. P -p powers <laughs> Hey, Dante! What are you gonna have her do? Oh, you wait. She might not look it, but she's something else. They won't take her down without a fight. You sure about this? Just wait. <laughs> yup. You should worry more about yourself, Moma. <laughs> I hate <Yep>. kids. <laughs> so, now you know your jobs. This is how we get through. I'm sure I don't need to tell you, but our objective is to reach the end of the harbor. We need to rescue Iris from that van and then get the hell out of here. Any questions? All right, let's do this. Perfect. Yeah, let's lock and load. We're coming for you, Tessa. On three, one, two, three, go! The reason why I'm so quiet is I'm, 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 I'm racking my brain trying to figure out where that's from. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> and so Operation Iris Rescue began. That's gonna bother me. I need to Google. <laughs> Focus on this, <sighs> this, this, this drama, this palpable drama, the suspense. It's killing me. All right. Where'd that accent come from? I don't know. Oto looked really funny behind the wheel. Hey, he look. did. Is that a tank? All right. That's not a tank. Let's do this. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're in the dark. Yeah. Kill him! Jesus Christ. All right. Pew, oh, pew, boy. pew, pew. <laughs> I think there was like a hundred feet between us all. <laughs> Damn. There's too many of them. I don't think my rifle can handle this many. I have to think of something. I, uh, 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 Iva. Iva. Almost said Iris. Iris <laughs> is on the other side. Wrong eye. Oh, yeah. Pop it. He's like, oh. hmm. I'm just like, I got this. <laughs> He's throwing something. I can't make out any of the details for anything else. Date, I have a plan. Yes. All right. Good plan. <laughs> Just listen. You still have that pornographic magazine, right? Oh. Don't act innocent. <laughs> I see everything Last you do. Last night you went back to Golden Yokocha. <laughs> you found one of those magazines and hid it in your clothes. How did you know? On your left eye, Date. Of course I would know. God. Damn it. 
In any case, throw it at the drum. Oh. No. <laughs> no, no. Why not? This is a collector's item. It's SSR. I can't just throw it away. Super, super rare. So what is more important to you, Iris or Eros? Eros. Hmm? <laughs> Iris. Good. Like, damn it. Hurry, they're closing in. Oh, uh, uh, wait, can't, can't we? <laughs> ah, I guess not. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that pained expression. Oh. Oh, wait. There we go. Take this! <laughs> okay, I'm glad to take it. <laughs> Could it be the legendary? Oh, this is amazing. No one back home will believe me. <laughs> My God. Look at that. They're all there. Gunfire stop. He's just like... <laughs> <laughs> My beloved. <laughs> no. Date, now! Shoot the drum! <laughs> <laughs> I was, now's the I time was for kidding. <laughs> what do you the drum is? contains flammable liquids. Do you understand? Fine. I got it. <laughs> it's like, no. I don't want to. Well, I mean, it's ruined in the rain now anyway. Exactly. Uh oh, wrong thing. Right, trigger bone. Nice. Bye. Damn. Dang. On it. On to phase two. Just right through the barricade. Hey, okay. Or not. He's just gonna stop at the barricade. None All of them right. are falling. Wave two. How do we do this one? <sighs> There's still more of them. And no more oil drums to blow up. I'm at my limit here. Wait. You're for round three. <laughs> I can drop the crane on them. I have uh, any ideas? I mean, I assume it's gonna be the crane. It's, yeah. it's the biggest thing here. Hmm. Let me see. Do your Iba thing. Another time with gusto. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> uh, he threw something. Did he throw his gun, or is he gonna shoot something after he throws? Or is it another Dante, magazine? Last night, you picked oh up something God. else, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> I told you, don't act innocent. Oh. oh. I'm talking about the panties and bra you shot down in Golden Yokocho. I needed it as evidence. Enough with your pathetic excuses. <laughs> Just Jeez. aim under the container. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> I was gonna give this to Reka as a gift. Someone else's underwear? Wine and underwear are best when aged. I... That's a famous saying in France. Is that it? That is not true. <laughs> Dante, what are you doing? Uh... Iris is in trouble. I'm having a crisis. He's like a teenage boy. <laughs> no. <laughs> there okay. was feeling in that line. <laughs> okay, okay. I just gotta throw it, right? Oh man. <laughs> it's like no. Don't look, Mizuki. <laughs> right. Bow. Uh. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Holy what shit, the dude! <laughs> this must be a gift from heaven. So wet, as wet as it gets. So dirty. Shameless, absolutely shameless. <sighs> it's like they're gawking at it. No, Reika. <laughs> How will you forgive me Good. now? That went well. Now, if we can cause that container above them to fall, there'll be blood all over it. I see it. Can't grab it I later. Can shoot the cable. Can you make the shot? Yeah. Then let's go. Don't worry, Momo. I got this. Yeah. You just sit back and relax. It's a very special gun. Come on, slow and steady wins the race. Oh God! There we go. Bump. This is going to oh, hurt. Shit, move! <laughs> okay, are they all jumping into the water? <laughs> I mean, that works. Yeah. 
because they can't get back up. <laughs> no. Let's go. Roger. They all have to swim. I'm the not long Roger. Way I'm Date. <laughs> <laughs> Quietest Hummer ever. Yeah. <laughs> right. Can y'all handle these many? Or is Mizuki Mizuki's about to like, give up and be like, "Let me fucking punch someone." <laughs> Once we get through here, then. What's the plan? Find them. My turn. With your pipe. Wait, Go, yeah. girl. Mizuki. Too late. Oh, that idiot! Cover fire. Cover fire. Or does she need her help? Which could also make sense. Ooh. Date, Mizuki can't do this alone. Yeah, no. Moma, cover me. Hey, wait up! I don't even know what I'm doing this time, so I'm just gonna go with it. Oh. Mashing A. Am I gonna do a superhero jump? Don't know. Whoa, yeah. Yes, yeah, we did. Damn. Thankfully, they're all worse shots than stormtroopers. <laughs> Point blank range doesn't matter. Bro, that, they're so of bad. None are hitting. Her. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> Makes you feel good about yourself, doesn't it, Momo? <laughs> Don't test me, motherfucker! Come on, like dead eye them. You got this. <laughs> Woo! He's the cheering squad. I can't fight. <laughs> uh, Mizuki. Jeez, that was close. We did it, right? Woo! Good thing he's with us. Nice luck, Mama. <laughs> They look like squished ants. That's a lie of bad guys. <laughs> thank you. Wow, a genuine thank you. Not, I didn't need your help. All right. Iris? Hey. My goddess, your chariot has arrived. <laughs> Dante! That was a delayed reaction. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Christ I Ota. hit you. Why don't, don't <laughs> never carry you like that again? Complete. Jesus. All right, got it. Bye. I mean, I'm surprised we're not gonna like try and see what's going on here, but hey, we could have handled Peter. <laughs> well, no, cause Iba, he could shut her down again, and you know. True. After that, we split up and booked it. Momo got behind the wheel of his vehicle, Oda took the van, and I got into my own car. Mizuki went with Oda, and Iris came with me. We drove off as fast as we could in different directions. The rain poured down endlessly. The neon lights of the city blurred faintly through the fine drops of rain. Okay. Huh. Ikume may try. Date. Moma and Mizuki contacted us. They're all safe. Cool. Good. Breathe a long sigh of relief. <sighs> Offering box. Anything to say about any of this stuff, or is it just talk, talk, uh, Roman Maybe the Arises? Shrine. Looks like rather solemn. Uh, lantern. Lantern. The Cho. The cho, cho, cho Zuya. You wash your hands face in here. Uh, number one. Uh, monument. Stone monument. Flower. Pretty flowers are blooming. Okay, looks like it's all yeah. pretty focused on whatever just happened yes. at the moment. So, hey there. I was looking off into the distance. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, I'm a lot better actually. I'm sorry, by the way, for everything. During our escape hours, got motion sickness. 
decided to pull over to Kumai Shrine so she could rest. Oh. Oh, and thank you. I never thanked you for saving me. You should be thanking those three. Some bodyguard I am. I put you in danger. Mm. That's not true. If it wasn't for you, I would have... Anyway, there's nothing else to say but thank you. Uh, did Pewter say anything? Yeah. Nothing in particular. I didn't talk to him at all in the car. What about the group of gangsters? They were all speaking different languages, so I didn't understand anything. Convenient. Hmm. About the winter iris. Looking at the iris again? Oh, yeah. I can't see it well in the rain. Hmm. You must really like that flower. Of course, we share the same name. Iris, the rainbow goddess. Yeah, that's what uncle taught me. The uncle again. Perhaps it is not the flower itself that Iris likes. This is your story. Oh boy, story time. Do you time. think the fruit of immortality really exists? Eh, probably not. Legend about the shrine? Yeah. I told you yesterday, I don't believe in that stuff. I see. But you do believe in parallel worlds and secret societies. <laughs> Shh, not now, I must. I experienced that in Iris' Sonia. This could be a negative side effect of the sink. It is possible that you've been emotionally compromised by Iris's morbid inner consciousness. Emotionally? Well, there is no point in discussing this now. About Uncle. I used to love Uncle. Not like romantically. I was 12 at the time, and Uncle was already in a relationship. You mean with your mom? Oh, you knew about that? <laughs> I've heard a lot. Like the Okonomiyaki incident? Yeah, the picture I drew. Right. We were always like that. We always acted silly and played around and stuff. I remember that in sixth grade, Uncle and I used to play hand games. Like what? Um, like ratty cakes. Ratty uh, cakes? <laughs> well, what? <laughs> it's like patty cakes mixed with rock, paper, scissors. Huh. How? Ratty cake, ratty cake, baker's man. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. Had it, poke it, fill it with fruit. Put it in the oven. Rock, paper, scissors, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. I win, I win, yay! I haven't <laughs> heard the full patty cake rhyme in it's so long. It's been a long, long time. <laughs> now, I want to say something quick. Because it could have implications on the game in a larger sense. Why do we have memories tied with memories that should be number 89s? Yeah. Because number 89 is supposed to be the uncle, but long ago we had a flashback of that very moment uh -huh. towards the very beginning. And, and it, our it first just wasn't tutorial the first Somnium. Thing. It was just that. Yeah. In our tutorial Somnium, we had the whole situation of what was going down in the back then times. Yeah. Interesting. What was Uncle's real name? Do you I don't remember? Know. Fuck! I only <laughs> called him Uncle. Mama called him Falco. Falco? <laughs> Isn't it a funny name? Sort of weird for a Japanese man. Oh, maybe he wasn't Japanese. I never found out where he was from. Before he met me, he committed some terrible crime. Z plural. <laughs> Many. <laughs> it appears that Hitomi and the assassin number 89 were dating. What? I mean, that's not a surprise to us. Now yeah. you have to take the penalty! DEATH! <laughs> up, up, side to side, up, down, pinch! <laughs> He's like, I would like to die. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, he let her do that, though. Yeah. Oh, they're at the shrine. Yeah, no, he, he seems number is with otherwise... Now kind of chill because yeah. it seems like he cared about her and you mm -hmm. know had fun with the food incident the whatever the heck that was called again the yeah. dish they made what the hell is going on here you know and he refused to kill them both <clears throat> yeah I didn't keep my promise my promise did you forget 
I told you that I would tell you who my late night visitor was if you went on a date with me. Oh, yeah. All oh, right. And we went on a date, so guess I'll tell you now. Sunday at 2 a.m., I was visited by... <laughs> something's, gonna, something's gonna happen. Or... I thought for a second she was gonna say herself when she popped up. Meh. <laughs> but, uh... I'm gonna say number 89. Same. Renji Okira. Oh. I... I... Uh, wait, I... Uh, what? Homie? Nani? He seemed really sick. Probably because of his injury. At the time, I had no idea what had happened to him. He was sweating buckets, and he came up to me with this begging look in his eyes. He said, come with me. He seemed really desperate. I couldn't say no. So I got into his rental car. We went somewhere, I don't know where, some deserted building. Mr. Okira got out of the car, then grabbed my hand. He tried to pull me inside. I got scared. I pulled my hand away and ran. Why didn't you tell me this? <laughs> Mr. Ogira has done so much for me. He took care of me as a kid. He helped me at Lemniscate. I wanted to trust him. No matter what happens, I can't think of him as a bad person. He was probably sweating because of an infection with the wound that didn't get <laughs> yeah. to do anything bad to me. He came to my house at 2 in the morning and tried to take me to an abandoned building, but... <laughs> you never know. Maybe he wanted to oh show my me God. some flowers or something that he found. Wishful thinking Why flowers? <laughs> a prank he was filming for the internet or something. Iris. And that's what I thought at the time. That's what I kept telling myself. But now. But after hearing everything you've told me, I can't see Mr. Okira the same way. Maybe he's a part of Nice. Maybe he's trying to... What did you do? What did you do after you ran away? Yeah. Well, I didn't go home. I thought he might come back. I just walked around and went into a bunch of stores, restaurants, coffee shops, net cafes. Places with cameras and witnesses. I was afraid that Good he idea. Didn't call me, so I turned off my phone too. And then at night, around seven, I think, I turned on my phone and got a Nile message from Mizuki. I want to stay at your place. I met up with her and took her home. I thought having her around would comfort me. I don't know. Uh, what happened to Renju? I don't know. I haven't seen him or spoken to him since. Hmm. Where did he take you exactly? Iris, I need you to tell me one thing. Where did Renju take you? The, the cold storage warehouse. Where did he take you exactly? Mm -hmm. It's been closed for eight years. The chemical plant in the Kawasaki district. Oh. oh. Hmm. Are sitting to the side. Well, let's go to the abandoned factory, I guess. I guess we're going there. Hmm. Why are we going to the place that he tried to take you? Gotta find clues. Is this the place? Yes. Where did Renju try to take you? That door in the back. Hmm. This is the warehouse in the Somnium. Oh, you're right. This is from the from the old Iris Somnium on the other the one line. with the weird TVs? Yes. Oh, it is. Oh, wow. There's the machine. Not quite what I was expecting when it came to it, because I thought it'd be over there, but he's got, he's had it kept away in here. Yeah. Hmm. This is a sink machine. Interesting. Though it appears to be slightly different than the one in Abyss. It looks dangerous. Could this be the prototype Peter was talking about? The Chiba Police Department was working on a prototype, but it was stolen six years ago. But what is it doing here? Hey, uh, Iris. Uh, Iris, are you okay? Oh shit. Iris, stay with me! Something's clearly wrong with her. She's been sounding off for a little bit ever since we showed up here. She doesn't sound like excited like she usually does. She's also been Iris's acting. Vital signs are going critical. What? Uh oh. What? Why? 
Unknown. But I believe the issue is with her brain. Her brain? Part of her brain is experiencing massive failure. Jeez. If this continues... Let's get her to a hospital. Impossible. You do not have enough time. I estimate that Iris's brain can last only 10 to 15 more minutes before the damage is irreparable. <gasps> How do you know that? I have scanned and analyzed her thoroughly. Her symptoms indicate that she will die within minutes. Oh my god. What? She has been having a lot of weird physical symptoms. Yeah. Like almost passing out, not being able to pick up a spoon. Maybe getting something. Dizzy. Maybe something about her thoughts on this whole knives at loss thing is deteriorating her brain, and we have to fix it by overriding those thoughts by sinking with her. It's or the, the knives at loss things are like a side effect of whatever's wrong. Oh my with god, her he brain. is sinking. <laughs> I'll use the sink machine here to go inside her brain. Well, yeah, it's, and it's, fix it's, it. it's set up <laughs> like that. <laughs> that will not cure her condition. I'm not trying to cure her. I'm going to save her. Two days ago, I saw her dead body. After that, we went into Sosajima's brain. And I saved her. And in his somnium, I saved Iris. And somehow, I saved Iris in the real world, too. Maybe you were in a parallel world or something. If I do the same thing again... Do you think you can save her? Yes. Apparently it's her only option. I, yeah. Please, help me. Is that an order? Yes. <laughs> yes. And I suppose <laughs> I have no choice. My mission is to support you. Alright. We don't have a lot of time. Let's get moving. Remember the whole thing about lightning not striking twice in the same place? I feel like this is going to apply here. Either parallel this worlds exist, or... Well... It is not identical to the one at Abyss. You said that already, so what? I do not know how to reset it. Oh. There must be a manual of some kind. We can't we reset. We need to find that before we begin. Find a manual? Uh, uh, hold on. I've seen many books over here, but medical simulation mannequin. It's creepy. Medical shelf. Shelf is full of medical chemicals. Uh, bookshelf. There are lots of books. I don't see a manual. Shit. Uh, a chair. There's a chair. Long table. I just table. realized something. Yes? Why is it raining in here? That's a bit of a filter problem. <laughs> no manual here. That is a that is a bit of a... Uh, oh, oh, that's well, why. Oh, no, that makes sense. <laughs> more sense. There's a hole in the roof. I'm saying because there's water, no there's water on the floor. But if you look over here, it's not. Okay, never mind. Shelf A. Or shelf B. But no manual. Shelf A. Is that that thing on the shelf? The manual's on that shelf. Well, grab it. Oh, is it, is it the chemical? Is it bottle of chemical? No, it's Where not. Where the fuck? Oh, right there. Get, get, uh, no, no. I'm trying. There, there we, we go. go. <laughs> Got it. It's like trying to find the slider on a on a window. Where you're trying to expand yeah. it. Yeah. You know? Believe it. Is there no reset? Because it's old, do you have to take out her eye? Does it not have the technology to go around the eye socket? Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, do you have to dislocate her eye? Remember? Yeah. Date, are you ready? Yeah, let's go. I think so. <laughs> oh boy. Cause like we had that uh that uh the the foreshadowing with that one character in Ocha's story. Yeah. And it's like, oh you can you can you know, it's it's pretty simple to put an put eye back, back in. in. <laughs> <laughs> that might be what there's medical stuff shovel around. Forge again. Yeah. More shovel forge! This looks kind of like the other time I synced with Iris, but there's a different atmosphere now. Hmm. <laughs> well then. Whoa! I decided to hold back this time. This is no time to be playing around. Oh, I heard. You heard that that aside, You want to help Iris, correct? Then we need to hurry. And by hurrying, we'll do this next time. <laughs> that hmm was at the exact same time with the same tone. Oh yeah. For the same length. 
with the same inflection. This is what happens. We become the characters, that is, and the characters that was, become us. That was scary. 